I'm William H and you're watching Super Thief and today we'll be sharing our top 10 best moments from The Mandalorian so far. With this Disney Plus series taking the world by storm with its first two seasons, there were definitely enough memorable, moving and simply jaw-dropping moments to choose from. As always, we love to hear if you agree with our choices, so make sure to sound off in the comments. Oh and before we begin, take heed, cause there are some spoilers ahead. Number 10. The Bar Brawl The show's very first scene immediately introduces us to our hero. We see the Mandalorian make his way into a bar on an unknown frozen planet. When he sees a customer get into a scuffle with some locals, he breaks up the quarrel by making short work of them. The prowess and gadgets he shows immediately establishes the Mandalorian as the badass bounty hunter that he is. But then the lucky customer finds out that he is actually the bounty Mando is after, showing us that our hero is all about his business. At least for now. Number 9. Mando's Wings In Chapter 3, Mando is backed up by fellow Mandalorians who make a splashing entrance courtesy of some iconic equipment Mando is still noticeably lacking, the jetpack. Then in Season 1's finale, Mando gets his own personal fly gear from the armorer. Although he stumbles a bit out of the gate, the combination of him and the jetpack immediately looks and feels just right. And it really comes together when in the episode's climax, Moff Gideon has Mando and company pinned down. With things looking bleak, he saves the day with some daring aerial prowess, taking down the already iconic villain's TIE fighter and in the process, giving us this modern Star Wars highlight. Number 8. Bo-Katan Kreese in Live Action As far as introducing characters to the show, The Mandalorian's second season really spoiled us. After already giving us the live action debut of the expanded universe character Cobb Vance, we next got Clone Wars and Rebels alumni Bo-Katan Kreese. The tough, gritty Mandalorian clan leader is convincingly played by Katie Sackhoff, who also voiced the character in the animated shows. What made her inclusion work so well is that not only does her story continue directly on from the animated series, she also confronts Mando with a different view on his Mandalorian vows, adding more depth to the show and its lead character. Number 7. Mayfeld's Revenge up to this scene, outspoken comedian Bill Burke's acting career mostly consisted of witty, nonchalant characters that seemingly reflected his own persona. Then we see his character, Miggs Mayfeld, take seat opposite his former Imperial commanding officer, Hess. First we see the anger rise in his eyes as he and Mando are forced to listen to Hess's Imperial propaganda. Then the storm inside him builds palpably as he describes the brutality of Operation Cinder, culminating in him gunning down Hess point blank. Seriously, the scene and its intensity gave us some serious Inglorious Bastards vibes, an absolute testament to the strength and diversity of the show scenes. Number 6. Boba Fett is back. Although his casting leaked beforehand, it was still an awesome sight to see Tamora Morrison as the Star Wars franchise's premier bounty hunter. Morrison already played Boba's son Jango in the prequels and voiced the character in the original trilogy's DVD release. Now we got him as an older Boba Fett and watching him wreak some serious stormtrooper havoc was a definite series highlight especially after he gets his father's iconic suit back. Number 5. Quill's End, Gideon's Arrival One of the memorable new characters the Mandalorian introduced in the first season is the eccentric farmer Quill. A curious combination of odd mannerisms and strong will, 
viewers quickly grew attached to Quill in his relatively sparse screen time. But then, in the intense chapter 7, we see Quill lay down his life to protect the child. His death hit like a ton of bricks, but viewers were left with no time to dwell as we're confronted with the dramatic arrival of series main villain Moff Gideon. Both these powerful scenes really drove home that the stakes were only going up from here. Number 4. The Mudhorn After the Razorcrest is stripped by the Jawa, Mando has no choice but to take on a job for them to get his ship's parts back. And that job entails returning an egg from a Mughorn. Mando throws everything he's got at the Horned Beast, but to no avail. The Mudhorn wrecks his armor and batters him into exhaustion. Finally, the filthy beast charges in for the finish. But then, the child steps in and we see him use the force lifting the Mudhorn so Mano can go in for the kill. Although we all knew Grogu possessed the force, it was still such a memorable moment seeing him use it in battle for the first time. Number 3. Ahsoka Tano in the flesh Even though we all knew the moment was coming, Seeing her dual lightsabers light up the dark for the first time was still an iconic modern Star Wars moment. After Bogota and a Cobb Vance, fans saw a dream come true with the live action debut of the Clone Wars and Rebel star. Rosario Dawson nails the look of the character while giving us a wiser but wearier Ahsoka than the one fans know from the animated shows. But it works! particularly because Dawson's portrayal still carefully retains the feel of the animated fan favorite. With their own spin-off imminent, we'll also be seeing much more of this beloved character in the near future. Number 2. The Return of Skywalker The climax to the show's excellent second season, everything about the re-emergence of the Jedi Master was captivating. It starts with the single X-Wing landing. Then we see the mysterious hooded Jedi deftly cut through a host of dark troopers who viewers had just gotten to know as very formidable threats. Everything culminating into that sequence where the hood is drawn back, revealing the face of none other than Luke Skywalker. And in some mighty believable CGI I might add. Amazingly enough, they managed to keep this one completely secret so fans were as surprised as they were ecstatic. And to add even more to this emotional roller coaster, the sequence led to Mando and Grogu's goodbye, as the former gave the latter his permission to leave with the iconic Jedi Master. Before we get to our unforgettable number one, here are some honorable mentions that just missed out on our top 10. Number 1. The Reveal We started this list with The Mandalorian's opening scene from its very first episode, and as the show's best moment, we chose the finale of that same episode. In search of a high-paying bounty, Mano travels to the planet Arvilla 7. Here he meets Quill, who directs him to where his bounty is located. Upon reaching the hideout, Mano reluctantly agrees to team up with a bounty droid. The ensuing climactic shootout is truly must-watch streaming, striking an immaculate balance between nostalgia and contemporary effects, the scene treats us to absolute top-tier cinematography and fight coordination. But then the smoke settles, only the droid and Mando are left standing, the camera pans to reveal the bounty, giving us the shot of that little green big-eared creature that instantly went viral, became an overnight meme phenomenon, and clinched our number one spot.
We hope you enjoyed our list and be sure to subscribe so you don't miss any of our upcoming Super Thief content.